Hello everyone, welcome to Tranquilly Coding. Today we are going to learn how to implement the splash screen API in Android under 3 minutes. This is the splash screen documentation from Android. Let's first check how does it look like. This is the simple example of the splash API. To implement this, we need to first adjust our logo. Google provided two set of instructions for adjusting the logo. This one is for the logo with background and this one is for the logo without the background. Let's go to Figma and make the changes. Here in Figma, I have already copied the reference image. We are going to use the icon without background, so we are going to use the non-logo instruction. Take a frame of 288 pixel. Inside the frame, create a rectangle of 192 pixel and inside the rectangle, create a circle of 192 pixel. Now, adjust the logo and put inside the circle. Make sure all is center aligned. Now remove the circle and the rectangle and also remove the frame background. Our logo is done. We can export it as SVG and import in Android Studio, but there is a shortcut. We can use Android Vector Drivable plugin in Figma and just get the XML code easily. Make sure we have selected the whole frame, not just the logo, and copy the code. We are done. Let's go to Android Studio and set up the rest. This is our basic setup in Kotlin. First, we need to add the dependency in our build.gradle.kts file. Create an empty drivable and paste the drivable code we copied from Figma. Now, create an XML file in the values folder for the splash theme. Give it any name and set parent to theme.splash screen. Set up window splash screen background to any color you want. Then set up window splash screen animated icon aka the drivable. Then window splash screen animation duration. This one is kind of useless, it doesn't have any effect of the actual time of the animation. And lastly set the post splash screen theme. This is the theme that will be set after the splash screen is dismissed. Now inside the manifest file, change the theme of the launcher activity to splash theme. Lastly in the activity, call install splash screen and we are done. Let's check it. As you can see, it's working perfectly, but the splash duration is too short. You can make it longer by using a handler and block the UI for the duration you want. Take a boolean variable, make the splash screen a variable, set keep on screen condition of the splash screen and pass the boolean. Create a handler and set the variable to false for the delay. In here we set 1000 millisecond, which is 1 second. You can set for any duration you want. Let's test it. Now you can see it's waiting one second. That's it for today. See you in the next video.